Welcome back to my series on the mistakes salespeople make. My hope is that by watching these videos, you'll avoid the pitfalls that can prevent you from being truly great. In this video, I want to talk about a little known mistake that can make a big difference in your sales. It's failing to connect emotionally with the prospect. Have you ever heard the phrase, people buy for emotional reasons and back up their decision with logic? I believe this saying. It's true much of the time. Let's think about the two types of people as presented by Tony Robbins many years ago. There are people who change to avoid pain, and there are the people who change to gain pleasure. Pain and pleasure are the great motivating forces in our life. Think about why you stopped smoking, drinking, or gambling, started exercising, went on a diet, quit a job, booked your dream vacation. In each one of these situations, there's either pain or pleasure or both. And more importantly, in each situation, there was some emotion involved in the decision. People don't just go on a diet for logical reasons. They want to feel better about themselves. They want to be attractive again. There's a lot of emotion here. If it was up to you to sell someone on a diet, would you just list the logical reasons why they should? Of course not. Now this is totally obvious if you're selling Porsches or high-end cruises, but what if you're selling software or roofing? Then what do you do? Don't just list the logical reasons. It can really extend your sales cycle. Learn to connect with your prospect's emotions. Let's look at software. Where could the pain be in selling software? We're inefficient. We're losing business to a competitor. We can't offer new services. We know we should be. Can you tell me there's no emotion in these situations? Take your sales skills to a new level by asking questions such as, what problems are being caused by you not making this change? What are those problems costing you? What if you don't solve these problems at all? And how does that make you feel? How does it make others feel around you that these problems exist? See how each of these questions gets to pain? What about these questions? These questions get to pleasure. What good things will happen as a result of making this change? How would it position you versus your competition? How would this affect your efficiency? Will it help you make more money? And how would that make you feel? Each of these questions gets to pleasure. You want to find ways to connect with your prospects emotionally regardless of what you sell and regardless of how logical you are. Get that last point? You might be a very logical person and that might actually be holding you back from succeeding at a higher level. I hope watching this video has opened your eyes to a new way of selling and connecting with your prospects to make you truly great. Good luck to you. Thank you for watching this video. If you'd like to learn more about me, visit my website, buildandbalance.com and look under the navigation for sales coaching or sales training. I'd also love it if you would subscribe to my channel, share my videos, and comment on the videos. I love to get comments from my subscribers with good questions and comments that related to watching these videos. If you'd like to email me directly, it's michael at buildandbalance.com. Thank you very much and good luck to you.